Hey, Ron. Got the hey, Joss or Bears broadcast up there for you. Oh, okay. Wonder what job I got today. Yes. Guess what? What? What's the board? <gasps> Their names are almost the same. Only an L stands in their way. They'll share the news with St. Mary's today. It's the Ryan and Rylan show today. Hello and welcome to the r, &R show. I'm Rylan. And I'm Ryan here with the 39th announcements of the school year. 39? 139 episode of the school year. Students are taking the ACT on April 24th. Please be checking your email. Students who are interested in playing sports next year, St. Mary's Health Clinic is providing free physicals on Wednesday, May 2nd. The senior class trip will be on May 11th. Those who are going to the full day trip to Worlds of Fun, remember to bring money and food that day. Lost and Found has many items that were left at after prom. Stop by the office today. Immaculate Conception will be hosting a blood drive on May 3rd. More, de more details will be followed throughout the week. FFA Kitty Barnyard is next Wednesday. Shirt money is $8 and due this Friday. Um, FCCLA members go to Miss Blair's room during seminar to vote on officers. There will be an 8th grade parent meeting this coming Monday at 6.30 in the high school commons area. Now with sports. Today, St. Mary's Baseball uh, will be taken on Concordia at Womega at 4 o'clock. The softball team will be playing today against Silver Lake at 4.30. Then on Friday, the Junior Varsity Baseball Tournament will be at Walmigo. The Suburban leaves at 2.30. Good luck, boys. Also, um, tomorrow is a track meet at Rossville. Good luck, boys and ladies. Hey, Ryland, do you know what numismatics is? Numismatics. Are you talking about numismatics? Who doesn't know about numismatics? Today, we have an abundance of numismatists here to discuss banknotes and forgery and the current circulating currencies within our modern society. And in honor of Coin Week, we have a segment where we went around talking to students about naming coins. Okay, so who is on the page? He's on the nickel. John Adams. Who is on the dime? I don't have this. I don't carry change. Honestly. He's on the quarter. Oh, please. <laughs> I, I don't know. Yeah, I don't He's know. On the I don't know. Who's on the penny? Oh, the, oh, the penny. I have no clue. Isn't it like Abraham Lincoln or something? Yes. Okay, okay, he's on the nickel. I have no clue. He's on the dime. Ask me who's on the quarter. He's on the dime. Ask me who's on the quarter. Okay, you don't know who's on the dime. He's on the quarter. Hey, get out of here, Abraham Lincoln. Not Abraham Lincoln, George Washington. My bad. Abraham oh, my bad, Lincoln. My bad. No, it's George Washington. No, it's George Washington. My bad, my bad. <laughs> Who's on the penny? Abraham Lincoln. Who's on the nickel? Eisenhower. Who's on the dime? Jefferson. <laughs> He's on the quarter. George Washington. There you go. Cha -ching. <laughs> what do you got? I honestly had no idea about the diamond nickel. Who's on the dime? Who's on the dime? Who's on the dime? Happy birthday to Macy and Madison Shaneman and Caleb Perry. Main lunch today is a sack lunch. And the alternate is also a sack lunch. Well, that's all what we have for the R&R &R show today. Until next time, I'm Ryan. And I'm Rylan. And, and you stay, stay classy, classy, St. Mary's. Their names are almost the same. Only an L stands in their way. They'll share the news. With St. Mary's today, it's the Ryan and Rylan show today.